All right, the fastest way to increase your speed in SketchUp, in my opinion, is to use the keyboard instead of finding icons. Pretty much, no matter what interaction you're doing with the keyboard, whatever program you're using, you know where the keys are. Doesn't matter what program you're using, the J button is still in the same spot, so you physically know where that is. It's muscle memory. Well, if, you have, if you're not familiar with SketchUp just yet, or maybe you are, and you don't necessarily know where some of these icons are located. I use the keyboard so much that I really don't know right off the bat where my actual tools are. But if you know where the keyboard buttons are, you can save yourself a lot of time by just not even looking over here, just changing commands while you're working on your object. So keyboard shortcuts, highly recommend, save you a lot of time. They are also located next to your drawing tools and your tools up here in your menus for quick reference. I was going to throw together a uh, nice little something you could print out with all the keyboard shortcuts but basically all you have to do is click up here and you can see them. The only one that doesn't come by default that I recommend you adding is dimensions. I, I have mine on the keyboard as D for dimensions, D for dimensions. And you can add that by going to Window, Preferences, go on your Shortcuts tab, and search for DIM for dimensions. Click whatever you want in here, press D, and then add it, and it will go down here, being assigned. And you can verify by pressing D and bringing up dimensions. That's the only one that I used that was not enabled by default, and I highly recommend it. So right off the bat, I can press Q for rotate. I can press E for eraser, R for rectangle, T for tape measure, A for arc, S for scale, D for dimension because I just added it, F for offset, P for push pull, L for line. Now you've got all your little stuff that you use all the time, uh, C for circle, uh, M for move, you got all of your little uh, keyboard shortcuts for all your tools right in front of you and your your hands probably already on one side of the keyboard as it is so highly recommend you using your keyboard shortcuts for any type of moving or any type of, of, of tool work that you're doing it saves you a lot of time and you can do all kinds of stuff without ever even going over there to your toolbars